Hi, it's Nancy today. Well, I'm down here at the new pond called Deepity Pond because it's deep. Anyway, um, I was I was using the net and getting out some um, sticks and leaves and things that had blown in because I swam a whole bunch of laps and all the leaves and the bits of air, the bubbles, had come to this side. And I want to show you what I saw. I was amazed. First of all, I saw three water bugs and I saw a frog. And not only did I see one frog, I saw a frog with a frog on his back. Look at this. There they are. I looked, I thought, oh my gosh, four eyes? What's with this? But this is the frog, and there's one on his back. Isn't that sweet? And now, of course, it's not his baby, because they come from tadpoles. Isn't that sweet, though? Froggy whacking, going playing leapfrog. And I was also surprised that frog would be in here before there's plants in here. Is that a stick behind him? It's not a huge tadpole leg or to get my glasses on so I can see it properly. Let's get a chair to sit in while we're over there. It must be just his placement. He just happens to be. <laughs> That's so cute. That other one, that top one. I don't know, is it a t this one bottom one's a bullfrog. How long can they stand or water? I 
Are they mating? Look, a little bug just went over there. Swam right past them. Water bug. It's amazing that the water bugs have found this. The water bugs were not here. Well, I can't imagine that they're mating because one is very different than the other. Well, what's he leaving behind? Are those the eggs? Is he just tangled up? like a piece of string there. Oh, it's eggs. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's frog's eggs. Oh, how awesome. Oh, isn't that wonderful? How interesting. So he's putting the eggs in the water. Well, that, that is just not what I expected down here. To see all this real life things happening down here. It's so cool. Those are all tiny frog eggs. So he came to the pond to Populate it with frogs. How cool.